Well, today we got Joe Budden, we got Ariana Grande and Pete Davidson, and we got Lil Wayne and Nicki Minaj. Not a lot of news today, so this is probably going to be the last story of the night. It's just some small things, guys. Okay, so let's get into it. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Hit that bell, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that bell, and when you hit the bell, make sure you say all videos, not just occasional videos. And also, make sure you hit that subscribe button for me and the thumbs up button. That's very important. Okay. All right, guys, so uh, we got Lil Wayne and uh, Nicki Minaj. They both have gone platinum on the same day. So Lil Wayne, Carter 5, Nicki Minaj, Queen, they both went platinum on the same day. That's coincidence. Um, and they seem to really support each other. I, I, you know, Drake, he wasn't on either of these albums, you know, and they weren't really on Drake's albums like that. Uh, the latest, latest album. Very weird. Uh and then we also, you know, we know what's been going on with Nikki with her feud with Travis Scott and everything. But she moved a lot of units and she went platinum. So that's great. And, you know, Lil Wayne deserves to go platinum. Lil Wayne used to go platinum in a week when albums really were being bought, you know. Uh, next, we got Joe Budden. He threatens to come out of retirement to battle Sci High the Prince because Sci High the Prince keeps coming for him saying he's gonna he's gonna get him and challenging him to uh to a rap battle well he said hey man i'll take two months off this podcast and prepare and i'll get i'll get Sai out of here <laughs> i'll put him in the ground so he, he he spazzed out on uh episode 212 at the uh i think at the 50 minute mark he goes he spazzes out on Sai the prince yeah, i'd like to see that battle and but you know i'd like to see joe budden come out of retirement and, you know Give us some bars. And the last story is pretty light. It's just Pete Davidson. For some reason, he thinks Ariana Grande is trying to sabotage his sexual his sexual prospects. So, like, any girls that are coming towards him, he's sabotaging it. I don't know. I guess because she keeps talking about everything that went wrong on, you know, with the Thank You Next record and everything. And uh, Pete Davidson says she's trying to keep him single. Um, what does it say? Uh, Sorry I dipped. I love you always. And most importantly, huge uh, stand-up. I don't, I don't know what the hell they're talking about this. Oh, and he said, I don't like that she talked all that shit about my pee-pee. So, talked about his private parts. Hey, this guy's being a baby, man. I'm going to be honest with you. Pete Davidson, you know, he seems like a nice guy and everything, but he's never been super, super funny to me. You know, I mean, he seems like a cool person, though. Just not super funny to me. Ariana Grande, she's cool. I mean, you know, it's just like, it was a stupid little relationship. It's nothing. Anyways, guys, that's it. I know I told you it was light news, but uh, anyways, guys, this is Jordan Tower with JT News. Hit that bell, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up button, and if there's not another story to that, there's not another story to that, I'll try. If not, I'll see you in the morning. All right, guys, peace.